At 23 years old, the UFC debut has arrived for Kylan Curran. I know you spent some time this week talking to one of her primary training partners and coaches, Mark Munoz, and he had a lot of nice things to say. These ladies are working harder than all the rest of us. You know, we got to get to work. He says she's one of the hardest working people in that gym. She's improved astronomically in her grappling and her wrestling. Weighing in at 115 and one half pounds. Fighting out of Eva Beach, Hawaii, Kylan Curran. This is a song that everybody in Hawaii should know because it's surf and it's like a super simple song. And it goes like this. hang out with like girls that, that do sports, it's kind of easy to just identify who you are and just, um, you know, just not trying to be someone that you're not. I really like to be the leader and I really didn't like to follow, so in Hawaii I feel like, you know, you're brought up to give respect to your elders and to the people around you and, and, and you know, just to respect your parents, obey, you know, and then just sharing the Aloha spirit. When I first moved here, it was really different because the people are obviously not the same. We're not obviously not raised the same. Over here, I kind of like built a little Ohana. Ohana means family and like everybody was super nice to me when I, I moved here. I like it here in San Clemente. It's a nice spot and it kind of reminds me of home just because it has the beachy vibe. And the people here are super mellow and super nice, so it's cool. I like it a lot. My boyfriend's name is Keanu Allen and Singh. He's a professional surfer. Um, he just qualified for the WSL, um, the tour for surfing. And um, I'm, I'm just proud that, proud of him and just happy that, you know, we, we technically been on this journey together. He still travels, of course, and I, I stay back and train. And he motivates me and he kind of pushes me to that next level, even though he's not a fighter. As a surfer, he's a competitor and that kind of like, we kind of share that together, I guess, just being um, athletes and professional athletes. I'm just thankful that we get to do this together and we just support each other 110%, so. You know, it's funny, like, everybody that surfs, they're like, I can't believe your girlfriend's a fighter. Like, I didn't know that. I was like, yeah, she's, she's pretty humble, you know? She's not really, like, going out there and like, saying, you know, I'm a fighter, you better watch out, you know? So it's Walking around like this. <laughs> it's cool to be, under one roof and, and trying to get things done in, our, in your own schedule. But it's all about balance, you know, balancing our times together and, you know, having my training and my surfing to supporting her and coming to her trainings. And um, I think there's a great balance between us both. But um, for both sports, it's it's preparation. You prepare your best, the best you can for this this moment, this, this date. And whatever comes at you is, is what you got to deal with. There was a goal of her making it to the, to the UFC. There was a goal of me wanting to be on the world tour. Mm -hmm. And now we, we really get to write the story and, and now we're living the story. I learned more from losing than I think I would have from winning. That's in a bad spot here. It definitely makes you want to get back in there and kind of redeem yourself. This is not a pageant show. We like to fight. Pretty girls can fight. Just being from Hawaii, you know. There's a lot, a lot of scrappy people, and I think it's in our, in our water or something. Like, no one lets anyone bully. You know, you just feel like I can protect myself, and I will. We like to fight. We don't move away from home just to come over here and play and try to drive to Vegas and try. To, there's no playtime. We're here for, for strictly trying to pursue our dreams and and. We're doing it together, so that's what makes it better. I'm gonna ride this out till I, till I can and fight until, who knows, till I become the world champ in my strawweight division.